Now that the pants are off, we can begin the video. So long past are the days where unlimited zombie horde game modes are new and exciting. COD Zombies has had the exact same formula since World at War, released 12 years ago. So it's safe to say that zombies need something new and innovative that could really switch it up, being just an endless horde survival game mode. And I'm just gonna say it right here, Black Ops Cold War or whatever that shit is called, it's probably gonna fail. Treyarch is definitely not gonna take a risk to go out of their comfort zone and make something new with the game that could potentially save it but no they're gonna stay in the same spot it's gonna be a black ops 4 remake this is coming from a guy where i'm excited and super positive about cold war zombies i just don't think this is gonna be good game it needs a dynamic change while still remaining to be an arcade game where the point is to get to the highest round on the leaderboard and really what zombies has been lacking is a reason to get to those higher rounds because at the end of the day it just ends up being the same thing over and over you start a match you knife the first three rounds you open a few doors to the box, you turn on the power, and it, every single game is the exact same. There's no mechanic of the game that makes the game even unique. And in my opinion, it shouldn't be based on the player to have to do challenges like, you know, doing a one hand challenge on a game to make the game fun. No, the creators have to throw something in there that really shakes a player up. And this idea that I have that could be amazing for the zombies game is a building mechanic now <laughs> That totally sounds like a meme right there, but I'm not kidding. Every time I think about a zombie genre, I immediately think about building because in a zombie apocalypse, you'd be boarding up your windows. I think about this all the time, like how I would board up my window so zombies couldn't get to my house, right? And how I could defend myself. And that's what I think. And my personal favorite game ever, Seven Days to Die, is a perfect example of this. But in my opinion, what makes Seven Days to Die so replayable is not just the zombie mechanics and the surviving days mechanics but it's the building aspect the fact that you can build your own base you could like trap it up so many ways to where make it harder for zombies to get to you is just so awesome i have never had a seven days to die game where my base was the same as another game it's always been drastically different it, and it could be something so simple like you put a certain amount of materials in the mystery box right and you get that from the mystery box and you can start building your base how cool would that be it would just be awesome and it would spark so many new genres of content there would be content of like trying to build the best base and then the whole community the first few months of the release of the game would be like trying to build the best base but the thing is there is no best base because it's there's always going to be something new there's always going to be something better and that just the thought of that excites me is a round based game mode but with building because let's be honest what's the point of playing zombies for high rounds i don't know anybody who even plays cod zombies anymore let alone cares about to getting to high rounds but imagine adding the aspect of building your own base you would try to survive those rounds as long as possible and this isn't a type of thing where you can just oh save the game and then go back to no so it's no longer the narrative of i'm playing to get to the highest round you're playing to protect that base you built that was very hard and it adds so many other aspects to the game right think about this you start a game you get a really bad start you can't build your base at all there's zombies everywhere the only thing you can do is train and then you get lucky with some box pulls you get the starting base you start building your base but then the zombies take it down it creates this whole story you started at zero and and then went up to here by the end of the game kind of like a game of day z if you've ever played that that game which even though i kind of hate that game in my opinion it's one of the best games for telling a survivor story but the thing is that doesn't happen with normal zombies it's just the same exact thing like oh oh boohoo you didn't get the uh the the thunder gun out of three three uh three chest rolls 
well th i mean that's the only story you can tell from a game of regular zombies but with this you would have a story of being at nothing and going to the top and then something else that could add an extra layer of randomness to all of this making the game even more fun and out of your control is every five rounds starting at the 10th round bosses spawn during that round the entire round with zombies and then they stay there after that so let's say round 10 hellhounds come in and then let's say round 15 napalm zombies start sprinkling in there right and then round 20 you got those freaking robots from garad crovey just coming in and anally destroying you anyways guys i really hope you enjoyed the video i hope i didn't ramble on too long about ideas that could be implemented in cold war but definitely won't happen because the game's already developed and ready to be published in uh november so you know none of this is gonna happen by the way this is all just ideas and me talking so i hope you guys enjoyed if you did enjoy it would mean a lot if you left left a like and comment a feature that you wish was in a cod zombies games because this is just my ideas this th there could be so much more that you guys could think of maybe we can get a custom map who knows and yeah if you did enjoy this content make sure to check out my other stuff and then if you do enjoy that subscribe and turn on notifications because you know i could make shit content so you don't want to subscribe just off this video so yeah anyways guys thank you so much for watching the video and i love you and i'll see you in the next one peace guys so long past the days of unlimited horde za za fuck so long past the days of unlimited Why can't I re- So long past-